this is Mark Rollins here from the Geek Church and Geekscape.net, and today we're going to be looking at two particular uh, robot toys that are already out for this holiday season. Uh, the Jimu Robot, the, start with this one, the Buzzbot, and uh, let's see, and Muttbot Kit. You heard it right, it is called the Muttbot Kit. It comes in a package that looks like this, and uh, as you can see, it's a kit that you can assemble here, um, made up of little, what looks like bricks that look very familiar, don't they, uh, <laughs> Isaiah? Um, yes, Yeah. They oh, do. Well, this is my son Isaiah, if I didn't introduce him. He's probably the uh, audience this is designed for. This is ages 8 and up, but Isaiah is 12, so hey. But hey, I'm going to play with this too. So it comes like this, and this box has a little magnetic flap. That comes up like this. Tells you all about it. What do you see? There? Wow, this is really um... yeah, okay. Build your Jimu robot. Make it move in four easy steps. Do you really think it's going to take four steps? I don't know what they count as a step. I don't, I don't, oh no! One of those steps is probably going to be oh, build your robot. Yeah, that's got to be wait, at least wait. like. Wait, oh, wait. What is it? Do you need to download an app? Yeah, we can do that. Yeah. <laughs> okay, it's on Google Play and the App Store, so we're pretty good. Okay. Yeah. Uh, so this open says here. open. Right here. Oh, uh, yeah. I actually think I think I tried opening this earlier. And oh, I guess that's like. Yeah, that's, oh, hello. Oh, here's oh, all the. Oh my gosh. The, the obviously not Lego pieces. Yes, these are not <laughs> Lego in any way. I given repeat, shape or form. no Legos. <laughs> okay, but notice how everything's labeled here. We got character parts, connectors. What does that say? I say. Recharging power adapter. All right, then we got robot servo motors. So uh, fast sinners, fasteners. Uh, main main control, control box. Oh, um, that might be the. Okay, let's one. pull out one of these boxes. We gotta pull oh, out this hello. one first. We got tabs here. Oh, and then we can just pull yeah, out the rest. Yeah, let's check out this. Okay, let's look at this orange one. What does this let's say? Just take everything. Robotic servo motors. Okay, well, that's gotta mean something. I want to see the character parts. So I think I'm just gonna. Okay, open these it look all like up. motors. Um, these are really. Hmm. Interesting. Really interesting boxes. I'm glad they labeled them. So I have no idea can. how this works, but since there's an Whoa. app, I'm guessing this is a lot like a another leg, uh, brick that maybe we could talk about that uh, it does operate using programming, and that is probably an entire probably worth an entire video, twelve videos on that at least. So okay. Let From me the looks of things, um, these are not compatible with actual Lego bricks. Oh so. really? Okay, because I just happen to have some Technic and. Uh, um, Lego Mindstorm bricks in my pocket, so I want to see just uh, if I can just uh, connect these things here. I don't think so. The, the holes look a little too small. Okay, obviously this isn't working. Yeah. Okay, obviously they're not compatible. Well, maybe they're not compatible, but yeah, the holes definitely look... Okay, is that what... Uh, what box does that come from, is it? This was the caricature part. Right, hold that up to the uh, camera there. Let's see what it looks like. Yeah, those definitely look like some great bricks to build with, all right. All kinds of uh, varieties of colors. Um, white, black, um, gray, orange, blue, okay. uh, red. All right, this here is the main control box in this uh, pastel blue thing. Really and important. Do not lose this. Yeah, oh, okay. we're not going to. I mean, it comes in its own Recommending box. that you do not lose that. Uh, looks like it takes some batteries. Got some ports for what look like. Those look like USB ports, I say. What do you think those look like? Uh, I can't, I can't sort of. They <laughs> sort of. Yeah, they got ports. a place. Okay. Oh, okay. So this is where the missing stuff comes in. Oh, shoot. Look at those little things. Yeah, we don't want to uh, drop those. But ones. we have a box. So okay. We have yeah, a box we'll, that we can put all yeah, these yeah. bricks in. Uh, let's see. Uh, any other box that you've... Um, also, this is part of the fasteners box. Oh, shoot. I better not lose those. Okay, this just says connectors. Oh. This is quite... Okay. This is actually quite complicated for ages 8 and up. <laughs> you know what? Honestly, I should have done, done a price point in checking this here. I'll put it on the comments in the video here uh, as far as the description on how much this costs, but let's put it this way. Uh, the Lego Mindstorm kits, your basic kits, will run you 300 to 400 dollars. This looks like, if it's cheaper than that, then uh, Lego Technic and Mindstorms have some competition. Now Isaiah, let's just put these things just in this box. We don't have to organize them for now, because we have another one we're going to look at now. Okay, this is the final box that we're going to open here. Recharging oh, power adapter. Open okay, yeah, check it out. Yeah, we didn't open this. Okay, it's probably just an adapter for the uh, thing. Oh, hello. Whoa, this so is... it looks like this can plug in the wall in some way. Wait a second. What is... Makes sense. <laughs> uh, there's the plug. Oh, um, we have a plug. Oh, this uh, is... It, it oh, attaches to this. 
Yeah, this is set up for uh, American outlets. Uh, I guess oh, if you don't have any European okay. outlets, yeah. that's gonna. I think outlets are different in different uh, countries and stuff like that. All right, we're just gonna push this aside for now. Just get anything that's loosely everything in there, and then we'll pull out the next yes. unboxing. Oh, oh, what could it be? What could it be? What could it be? A unicorn? No, no, it's not it's, a unicorn. Come it's... on. Another one this of these is the Tankbot kit from Tank. Jimmy Robot. Now I believe the company that makes this is called Ubisoft or Ubisoft or something like that. It's not Ubisoft because that's a video game company, but same kind of format. We have this thing, Whoa. magnetic flip, and we can see this. Uh, oh, look at this! Does this robot remind you of anybody? Just um, <laughs> Wally. Kinda, yeah, there is you that go. You? <laughs> Wally number five, that guy kind of thing. Ah, it looks like you already opened this one. So, uh, yes. Uh, Whoa. This one's a little bit. This one's got a quick stirk. Oh, hello. Whoa. Oh, there's a guide there. Oh, oh. good. That, uh, I'm definitely reading this. Oh, okay. Uh, let's not overshadow the other boxes. Okay. Can we get a shot of these boxes here? As you can see, we got the pastel colors again. Fasteners, character parts, uh, main control box, connectors, and what does it say again? Is that, what does that say? Recharging power adapter. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Wait, but where's the... What? It's empty. Quick start guide is empty. Okay, this might have been just for this model, but uh, or this particular, but that's not a good sign here. But uh, hey, we gotta keep this on the video because uh, this is an unboxing. Yeah, more character Sorry. parts. More. Oh, this hello. is really different uh, from the other box. Robot servers. I really thought it was just gonna be the same. Okay, um, should we? Is if it looks the same, uh, I don't see any reason to open these things. Main it looks control like control box, fasteners. These things look pretty. Yeah, these things look the same. What about these connectors? Yeah. I feel like I feel like there would be actually yeah. new pieces. Yeah, check them out. Okay, maybe we got some new pieces here. Yeah. Obviously, we got the tank treads. I don't believe that. Whoa. The, uh... Okay. <laughs> oh, hello. That's a lot of. This is a lot of connectors. <laughs> Should I make the comparison between a certain other uh, brick that starts with L? Okay, I, that I mean, that's, no, no, no. that's, that's yeah, character. Yeah, okay, no, it's not. Character parts, <laughs> main, yeah, uh, everything's just the same. I don't know about the quick start guide, though. I really uh, thought it's, there was uh, all right, there. well, hopefully, yeah, no kidding. Uh, there might be, yeah, is there no instructions on how to build this thing? Most Lego kits have the instructions in brightly colored thing, like, right off the bat there. Yeah, like a, I don't know, a turk. Although, in their defense, some of the other things, like the Technic things or some of the Mindstorm things, they, you have to get a program for some of the Legos, so maybe this is the issue. This is a perfectly good um, box, and they put nothing in it. Uh, did you, okay, well, maybe <laughs> this is a went uh, accident, uh, you know, like... Uh, it could have been an uh, Okay, yeah. We'll I bet you have to download contract. the app in order to find the instructions. I would not be surprised if you did. All right. I bet they missed... Um, I bet they missed like a paper that says go download the app for the instructions. Okay, so on the whole, it looks like the Jimmy Robot kits. One is a walking robot. The other obviously has some tank treads. So I imagine that I don't see any wheels. Do you see that? I mean, we've got tank treads, but we don't have any like every Lego we kit that I know. We has didn't wheels. Is there wheels? There's yeah. the character parts. Yeah, yeah. Hmm. All right, I'm surprised. Here's the wheels. Oh. And I guess uh, this is the character parts. It looks the like there's treads, but there's no wheels. Okay, well. Uh, Obviously, some needs to make that. Yeah, there's treads, but no wheels. Okay, well, hey. Obviously, we can do a lot with these things. The fact, uh, there's no real... Unlike the Mindstorms things, I don't really see a lot of gear pieces or anything like that. Or axle pieces. Uh, oh, no. Uh, there's something like that, maybe. I actually I can't really see what that is. But for the most part, they're using the basic connectors and things like that. Um... Do you see anything that's axle really? You know those uh, little cross plus shaped things that are there? I don't really see any. No. Okay. Well, hey, I mean, you never know what you're going to get with these. Isaiah, what's your thoughts on these uh, toys here? Um, it's really interesting. I'm really surprised it's not Lego. Really, <laughs> I really thought it was going to be it. So um, in other words, I can't believe it's not Lego. When I saw, yeah, I can't believe it's not Lego. <laughs> well, in this case, it obviously isn't. I mean, it's labeled that way and... Uh, I'd say Lego has some competition with these things, for sure. Uh, whether or not it's... Uh, well, hey, whether... Yeah, Lego's a monster, all right? We know that, okay? <laughs> but, um, shoot. Uh, for something like this, I mean, maybe this might be a good low-budget alternative, especially if you're trying to make kids. I mean, granted, Lego's got all the robot um, competitions and stuff like that. Uh, this, obviously, is not uh, gone that far yet. And good luck trying to get that stuff back in there, I said. <laughs> <laughs> it was like a puzzle. Welcome to the boxing show.
All right, uh, what do you think? Would you like to play with these, Isaiah? Uh, yes. Okay, maybe we can do another separate video on that, but maybe not. But I think that's all for now, and uh, we hope this you enjoyed this unboxing video. Um, and uh, if you have this product and you use it, uh, please leave a comment down below. Say goodbye, Isaiah. Bye. Right. Goodbye.